Guys, I'm Leslie, so today I'm going to show you how to do um, a gooey duck. I'm not a professional, so do try this at home. Kids, go ahead and try it. So I just want to show you, first of all, our kitchen. It's really tiny, a very small kitchen, so please take a look at our kitchen. It's like 120 square feet or something like that of actual usage. Um, it's actually probably smaller than your average home kitchen. For that so what I'm doing right now is I'm boiling some water. And what we're going to do is, you notice that we use induction in a uh, live flame. So this is the gooey duck, or the giant clam. Uh, Chinese call it the Just drop it in hot water. Right so I'm gonna count 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, 1,006, 1,007, 1,008, 1,009, 1,010, 1,011, 1,012. Should be good enough. So let's take that out. Oops. Okay, and you want to put it in a container because there's going to be a lot of water when it comes out. So what you do is just do that, put a spoon in there, upside down, separate the first shell, turn it around, separate the second shell, see all that water coming out, and just split it open, do that, and we got the gooey duck. That's it. So the shell you can leave, set it aside, use it for presentation. Now if you notice here, the skin is already coming off. That's because we put it in hot water, blanched it, and it will not cook the meat. The temperature difference is too vast, so the meat will not cook. All right, so you take that off. Notice how it's coming off really fast. Okay, so we have to continue where we left off. The problem with the iPhone is that uh, the phone call interrupts the video. Okay, so taking off the rest of the skin. There you go. So that is gone. We'll need that and what you do then is you can use a knife or a pair of scissors and just pierce through the edge there and take out the internals just peel it off the skin some people like to sashimi that part um, we do that as well but today I'm not going to do that okay so here it is this is the gooey duck prepared just water now all you do then Take gooey duck, okay? Some people put it back, back on ice. I would put it back on ice normally, but let's just continue with the demo. And just cut in the middle. And you notice, it's incredibly clean on the inside. Take off the top, and there's got a little bit of that skin left, so that's gone. And what do you do now? Well, it's very simple. Just start shaving the whole thing. You'll notice that I can get really, really nice thin cuts because the fresher the product is, the thinner the cut can go. For the trunk, I'm going to do it this way. Nice and long strips, nice and crispy this way. And then as I get close to the end of the trunk, I'm going to turn it around and do smaller strips. It should only take you under five minutes to get this all done. It's probably taking a little bit longer today because I'm explaining stuff and getting interrupted by phone calls. Right. And if you notice that we use pretty much most of the gooey duck. Right. We have the trunk here and then we have the under the shell. So I'm just going to give it a little toss just to get it nice and crispy. Then. For our presentation purposes, what we like to do is we like to put it in we like to put it in a glass or well, ice cup actually, not really a glass cup. There we go. There you go. That's how we serve our gooey duck.
I think that took under five minutes, um, plus the interpreter of the phone call. So five minutes and 20 seconds. Pretty easy to do. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, give us a call.